this business, from what I understand from Janelle, especially is like a hockey stick where it's right here and it's just about to hit the slope and take off. It's so new. It's so new that anybody that's in on it now is just going to explode if you're willing to put the time in. It's beyond easy. Follow directions. Don't reinvent the wheel. Someone's already tried it. If you just do step one, two, three, and four, and you're patient, you keep doing it, you'll make the money. This business works. This business works. It's not a gimmick. You're not selling soap. You're not selling potions. You're not selling pills. You're not selling BS. You're selling fitness and nutrition. Not like that, you're not even selling easy fitness. You're selling stuff that really works, that really makes you sweat, that's hardcore. It's the kind of stuff you do at the gym. It's legit. I, you know, being in, in, in the position that I've been in, I have been, as many of you have probably, approached by dozens of people who are multi-level marketing, saying, oh, you've got this, you've got a, 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 an audience of people who follow you, you'd be great, blah, 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 blah. Not interested, just not interested. I don't want to do any of that. This is legitimate, it's fitness. You can't argue with the fact that people need to exercise and they need better nutrition, that's it. And they need accountability, and that's what coaching is. To be honest, it's, it's not for somebody, in terms of making it a business, to make it an opportunity that's a business, it's not for someone who's a pessimist, um, completely disorganized, and um, zero follow through. Fine, you'll be moderately successful. When I meet other fitness professionals, they all want to have their own video, and they all want to open their own gym, and they all want to do their own boot camps, and they all want to do personal training. And I think, oh man, they're just going to think I'm, I'm, I'm saying this because I'm related to the product, but don't waste your time. This is so flippin' easy, it's stupid. <laughs> I mean, you can't start a business for $34. You can't buy a shirt for $34. <laughs> it's 30, it's 30, 30. Okay, 39 <laughs> You know, and, and everybody wants to do it. They want to open their own gym. Even just recently, I had APDs who were out training to become new APDs, and one of them was saying, she goes, when this is all over, can I talk to you? I want to talk to you about opening my own gym. And I just want to take her head and go bang, bang, against the wall going, why? Why? This is so much easier and so much more fun and so much more and so much quicker. So much quicker. And after you, you've made five hundred thousand dollars after two years, then open up a gym if you want to burn some money. And then one of the gals who was uh, the very top, one of the top performers, uh, she just started in January and she was only in the top twenty of the whole organization. And absolutely every one of them is online. And she goes, I just post videos of myself making shakes or talking about my workouts or talking about my progress. And I just, I target other moms and I offer advice. And I tell them what I eat and I tell them what I'm doing. And I don't talk about the product until they ask about it. I, I'll tell them what I'm eating and they see that I'm replacing my dinner with a Shakeology. And I send them, I fax them, or I, I email them my sample, my sample food plan for the week. And then they ask, what's the Shakeology thing that you're doing for dinner? And so it's really, um, I just want you to know that the most, I, I know this firsthand because I interviewed them. And I was very surprised to find out that the top producers in this organization are the ones who are helpful. As I always say, I'm average in every way. The way I outwit everybody is I make a list every day. And, it's, and people are like, this. Can I see your list? It must be magical. <laughs> it's really not. It's just very, very basic. I just make one every day. And, and you go on my Facebook, every day on my Facebook, there's like 20 people like, can we see your list? I'm like, you'd be pretty bored. It's like, return this email, make this phone call, attend this meeting, pick up the kids, buy a grocery. There's nothing magical on it. I just make one every day. And, th and then you get the things done that you need to do before it's too long, before it's like a week is past and you go, I should have done that. I needed to do that yesterday. If you make a list every day, you can't help but be successful. And in this business, it isn't about having to be creative. It's just doing what the person above you tells you they were told to do, and it works. It's just really basic. I'll hear people say, well, don't you think the market's really saturated? <laughs> like, and I'm like, with what? Obese people? <laughs> <laughs> the market 
market is saturated with potential customers. There is a bazillion obese people and their families and their children. Trust me, there will always be opportunities to help someone become healthier. And even if you know your next door neighbor is a beach which has nothing to do with it because this is honestly, and it didn't used to be this way, it wasn't this way three years ago, but in the last couple of years it has truly become the most successful people are doing it online through social media. Through connect, connecting with weirdos and creepy people, but people who are just like you <laughs> and look like you and have your same interests but live in another state. Conversations. It's not sales. It's like, hey, if you tried uh, Shakeology, I get it for you for 25% off. Simply visit my website. No, that's sales. <laughs> you know, that's sales. Nobody's interested in that. People are interested in saying, yeah, I had a baby too six months ago, and it's very challenging. Or, yeah, I used to be a high school athlete. My knees bother me, so here's the program that I'm using. Without pushing. As, as soon as you're resourceful and help, helpful with people, then they are comfortable and they let you in. What people don't want is to be hustled or sold. And think about it, when you hear a knock at your door and you know someone's selling something during the door, you mean you want to answer the door, right? When you pick up the call and you know it's a telemarketer, you're like, don't you just, you're just like, eh. You'd like the hair on the back of your neck stands up and we want to run from anyone who's soliciting or selling. The same is true of this business. Just be helpful, don't be pushy, tell the truth. And if you do that with 10 people, two will become customers. Of those two, one will become a coach. And you operate that way. The people, And you're gonna see people online who are like, 25% off, you get it from me, and P90X, blah, 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 blah. You know, all those people, no one's doing business with them. You always wanna help lift people up, and it comes back to you tenfold, you know? It really does, that's how the universe works. And people who, you see this, they squander and they hide what, whatever it is they're doing and they don't want other people to become successful or to know what they're doing in this business in particular, or any business. It just, it comes back to bite you in the butt. It's like the more free you are about sharing your information. It's true, it does come back to you. It comes back to tenfold when you help other people. And I don't know the ins and outs of coaching, I just know it's helped a lot of people. I'm getting nicer Christmas presents. <laughs>